Hello, my name is Tyler and I am your Puzzle Master Insider. Today I'll be giving you an inside look at six individual paper puzzles and a puzzle magazine from Sam Lloyd. For those of you who have never heard of Sam Lloyd, here's a bit of history on Sam Lloyd the man. He was born in Philadelphia in 1841. At an early age, he developed a love for chess, and by 1850, he was an accomplished chess prodigy. His first big puzzle was the Trick Donkeys. And in this puzzle, you have to cut uh, with scissors down these two lines, separating the riders from the donkeys, and you have to position the pieces in such a way that it looks like the riders are on the donkeys racing each other. I'm not going to show you the solution today, but if you flip over each card on the back, there is a, a history of the puzzle itself. And uh, this puzzle was famously used by, by showman, circus showman P.T. Barnum, who, raised, who renamed the puzzle Barnum's Trick Mules. Sam Lloyd's second big puzzle is called the Pony Puzzle. The idea here is that you cut out the pony shape, cut out each of the four legs and the, the tail, creating six pieces. And what you want to do with those six pieces is rearrange them into as many different ponies as you can. On the back of the card, there's a bit of a history on the puzzle, and from that it says, On the return voyage from a trip to Europe, Lloyd went past the famous White Horse Monument on Uffington Hill in Berkshire, England. The then Governor of Pennsylvania, Andrew G. Curtin, who was a passenger, suggested that a puzzle might be worked up about the colossal figure of a horse engraved on the side of an old English hill. Lloyd at once volunteered and in a few minutes produced the Pony Puzzle. Another popular puzzle by Sam Lloyd is called Get Off the Earth or The Last Man. In this puzzle, uh, you can rotate it back and forth like this. You'll see on the back here that there is a pin that allows you to rotate one way or the other and kind of stops it from moving too far. So if you rotate it to the one direction, and count the men. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Here's where you'll see the trick or the mystery, I guess, as it is. So you rotate it completely the other direction and count the men. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So the mystery is where does that thirteenth man come from? Next, from Sam Lloyd, I have three puzzles that are postcard sized puzzles. First one's called Alice in Wonderland, second is the Japanese leapfrog puzzle, and third is comical transformations. So in the Alice in Wonderland, it's got, uh, was it a cat I saw here written out over and over? You gotta find how many different combinations you can do to make, was it a cat I saw? Second is this Japanese leapfrog puzzle. It's got three frogs going different ways here, uh, and you gotta jump the frogs and get the three frogs from one side to the other and vice versa. In this third one, Comical Transformations. It's got a face here, and you can see the guy's face a little more clearly this way. But there's a number of different faces and figures inside of this picture. On the back here, it explains and find, you have, it explains which ones you have to find and what they are. So it's three postcard sized puzzles. There's a whole bunch more of these. Sam Lloyd also has the R Puzzle magazine here. And it's got a whole whack of different puzzles inside. There's any number of word puzzles, picture puzzles, uh, things like that. So something to check out. And they've got this magazine, which is very interesting. You get a lot of stuff in there. And again, just really great construction, great pictures, and uh, something interesting from Sam Lloyd that, that you could take along on a trip or, or something like that. One interesting fact about Sam Lloyd the man is that he has been credited as the inventor of some 10,000 different puzzles. The company that to this day still bears his name has taken up the mantle of creating some pretty awesome puzzles as you can see and, and puzzles that are, are well made but not expensive. Uh, they're just, just awesome stuff and, and on their website they actually have a, a guarantee that goes as follows. Each product created by the Sam Lloyd company carries the Sam Lloyd signature label. This is your guarantee that the product you have purchased is a genuine Sam Lloyd article that has been created using the very best techniques and materials faithful to the standards set by Sam Lloyd over a century ago. Each puzzle goes through a stringent 10-stage phase before it is worthy enough to carry the Sam Lloyd signature 
and made available to you throughout the world. These six paper puzzles and the magazine along with many other products from Sam Lloyd are available on puzzlemaster.ca and you will find a link to them down below in the description. That wraps up today's video. Make sure to subscribe to the Puzzle Master YouTube channel, like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Thank you for watching and I hope that you have a very puzzling week.